And the failure modes of a transaction-based mutex were that if a server node went down, it would behave the way developers already understand a transaction behaves. The SQL server connection will die, uh, and the transaction will be rolled back. The changes will not be applied. So uh, this is what the code looked like. We grab the mutex. As you can see, uh, if you know C-sharp, it's an A disposable. Uh, and then we do the thing, basically. We, we do the thing that's going to mutate uh, the object. <laughs> if you've been writing software for a while, oh, well, you may immediately see the problem with this, um, which is that you have to rely on a developer to remember to write that first line to take out the mutex before you mutate the thing.